Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Tyke and Roost. Uh, this is Amy. And Matt. And uh, we're going to have Amy play again because uh, we have recorded. We have recorded this and uh, it lagged a lot, so we uh, replayed the, uh, or excuse me, we loaded the uh, last save for it. And uh, yeah, we'll see how she does in this. Um, unlike, unlike the previous video, I was. I was very, very moody, so um, I'm sorry about that. It's Can you just. Go around real quick? Work's kicking my ass, <clears throat> naturally. And, uh, I don't want to keep bringing up work into something I want to consider a hobby, but uh, other than that. Mm, got a piece of jewel. We're going to try to uh, do this one. We're going to do uh, a shrine immediate to the. What's the right side of the map? East? I think it's, uh, yeah. Okay, every time when I think west, I always think of the western times, and every time when I think of the western times, I always keep thinking of California. What are you doing? You better duck. Wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, it's fine. I'm going to be fine. All right. Okay, that goes... I'm going to check on the other side real quick. All right. Yeah, I always think uh, California, so... Whenever you hear West, think of California. California is the left side of the United States, so yeah. Biggest um, uh, state. In terms of our map in Breath of the Wild, uh, east is right. So we need to go to the shrine immediate to the right. And uh, luckily, if you guys remember the old episodes, um, I, uh, I activated it, but I never uh, completed it. So, uh, yeah, what in the world? Oh, yeah, it's not. It's floating. It's not it, gonna. It's not heavy enough. Nope, it okay. ain't heavy enough. So I have to figure out how to do something. Go ahead and uh, use your magnesis here. See if there's anything in the water. Nope. Nope. Okay. Well, I think I might have an idea. All right. But I mean, I was gonna say, don't, don't you just need to shoot an arrow at that little crystal to get um, rid of the water? Yeah, but I can't do it from that angle over there because I don't have enough. Uh, Oh, then how, how about this? How about you go use Cryonis to the right, throw a bomb over there, but don't detonate it, and then swim back. Right here? Yeah. Gotcha. <sighs> yeah, pretty soon, guys, in the future, just so you guys are going to be expecting it, um, we still haven't showcased, uh, uh, da -da 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 -da, what's his name? Max Brass? And uh, the newly uh, released um, Lola Pop, as well as Headlock Mode for ARMS. So we're going to get back into ARMS pretty soon, guys. Uh, uh, sorry we've been neglecting that that recently. Yeah, I mean, I, I told myself that I was going to do a... Uh, um, what do you call it? You, you just go ahead and swim back through there. Okay. Yeah, uh, I, I don't... I mean, I was going to... Um, Excuse me, guys. I was gonna um, make more thumbnails for them for their own special, you know, characters and everything. And uh, just in case, um, there has been a minor backlash from somebody at work. I forgot to mention this to you, Amy. So apparently, uh, uh, there was a fan of uh, Twintel over at work one time, and they're like, "Why do you need to wa whitewash her?" Really? Yeah, and I'm like, I just. Okay, whenever I would make a thumbnail for, our, you know, personified characters or whatever that resemble us, not only that, uh, yes, you know, don't, don't hate everybody. I mean, it's just, it's just an art concept that I always like because it, it makes the uh, characters more relatable in a way. Like, I'm not whitewashing Twintel, just like how I'm not whitewashing Ninjara because, you know, if we want to go ahead and put race, you know, even further since, you know... Ninjara does seem Asian, you know, whatever. All I can say is that's just room for people to just complain. It's really dumb. I, I don't see why that's a thing. I didn't, uh, what, what's wrong? What are uh, you doing? No, it's just there's a chest up there. I might as well skip it. All right. Yeah, yeah I was going to say, like, I'm not trying to whitewash anything. It's just the reason why uh, she has, you know, light skin is because since Amy's Mexican, you know, she has the uh, fascination of the uh, you can go ahead and skip that mm -hmm. she has a fascination of the uh, gothic culture so you know of course Amy's skin is going to be pale and you know she's Mexican alright it, it's really dumb that people would just want to find room to complain it's just 
if, if that's the case, then hell, I'll, I'll make my thumbnails boring from now on. It's just, it's a lot of work. You know? It, it's just like how I put uh, Zelda's hair black and everything because Amy has black hair. It, it's just, I, I don't know what the hell is wrong with this person. I'm not going to say this person's name just to protect their identity or anything, but I find that it's very unnecessary, you know? It's if you look at the completionist, he he always puts you know beards on every character, you know. And hey, in my opinion, I don't think beards are attractive. I mean, but if that's his thing, then that's his thing, you know. So, uh, yeah. it, it's it's just the internet, really. I, I mean, to if, be honest, I agree with you, Matthew, because um, I mean, it does. I mean, like to be honest, like if you're gonna complain about that, you're really you're really just trying to like backlash of other people's creativities. It's it's more than that. All I can say, it, it's just it's just room. That's really what it is. It's room for somebody to complain. I know. You know, it, it's just like any other thing. That's like, uh, for example, cosplayers are the biggest victims of this. Of course. You know, so that that's what I mean. Like, we like these characters, you I know, mean, but we, we also it, it's we're not trying to do anything to you know offend anybody. We just like them so much, so. It's it's just okay. Pretty much, I'm just gonna you know bring this to a close because I don't want to waste like the entire episode complaining Ooh, about it. Test of strength. Ooh, nice. It's gonna be fun. Let me it, double check my gear to see if I'm okay. You're good with the one you have because it's the highest defense. All right, this should be easy. Yeah, I mean, long story short, you know, it, it is what it is. You know, I you mean, know, it's just. To some people, like me, it's just another voice from an RTV screen or, you know, text from the internet. That, that's really what it is, you know. So, it's just like Xbox, you know, if there's somebody going to, you know, complain about you or, hell, even Nintendo, hopefully, if they ever upgrade, then, yeah, just just tell them or, you know, just tell yourself, you know, they're nothing but voices on a TV screen. You know, that's, that's how I feel about it. So, if anybody's going to complain about my art, cool. You know, I, I respect criticism 100%. It's just, oh, careful. I'm just gonna have fun doing this. Why not? Yeah. But, you know, it's. it sucks. It, it's stressful when you, you know, come to some place and everybody's like, oh yeah, I've seen your channel, and then you just talk shit about it, you know? <sighs> anyway, uh, it, it, don't worry about that gear. Okay. Say, you, you have, you know, by far the strongest gear possible. Okay. Alright. So, after this. We got to go to a tower. Okay. Tower should be nearby. Oh, oh and for future reference, uh, actually, you know, off camera, we should go get that uh, chest, the one from the previous shrine, because uh, we, we might get... Uh, might as well drop this. Yeah. We, we might get uh, climber gear or something like that. that. That was one of the reasons why I was kind of like, you know, meh, go for it. All right. Let me see. All right, go ahead and skip. Well, as soon as it allows you to. Yeah. I gotta edit this part out. To be honest, I kind of like these little like uh, these little design parts where the monk is at. Mm-hmm. All right. But anyway, I kind of agree with you over there because that's just that's just more like yeah. people who just like to use their prejudgment. I mean, prejudgment, you know? Or, yeah. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, so... Oh, I think he's there. Yeah, that's that's Sidon over there in the distance. But uh -huh. uh, let's let's ignore him for now. Um, let, Let's go up to the tower first. Yep. And, and then there's... we'll see uh, Prince Sidon. Okay. Oh, get that radish. Oh, yes. And that's room. All right. That tower is... Right in front of you. Right up there. Oh, man. It's quite a climb, so... Yeah, uh, and it's raining. <laughs> Yeah, it, it's there's still a pathway though. Pathway. Yeah, you can still just kind of path your way up there. So if you go ahead and glide through that little dip over there, right here. Uh, left. Right there. Oh, okay. Let me see. Just just pretty much glide, and then I guess whistle exploit yourself up, just so you don't have to worry about slipping. Okay. Hopefully you don't slip. All right, you're good. Okay, then pretty much just kind of waltz your way up. And, you know, since this still is the fairly beginning of the game, you're already overpowered as is, so... Yeah. These guys shouldn't pose too much as a threat. 
If anybody's wondering what that glowy stuff is in the background, uh, it is, is a place. Yeah, it is a point of interest, but it's not that special. But we will let you know that apparently there is a mountain god over there, which is an underwhelming. Oh, what did you see that? What time is it? Uh, Eleven. Okay, uh, break. Get, go ahead and get that star. Oh gosh. Um, if anything, go ahead and uh, press the map. Press the map. Press the map. Okay. Oh. From where you're facing, go to see see where you're facing yeah. the the other shrine. This one. Yeah, that one. Oh goodness! I just can't believe we have to break from our from our uh, current uh, destination just to get to this little thing that just popped up out of nowhere. But we definitely need this thing. Yeah, we already. Well, we can still teleport back. Yeah. Okay. So immediately find where the uh, the star piece is at, and then uh, teleport back. Well, well, after you get it, of course. Um, oh shit. Yeah, I, I know the, I know the, uh, the deal. <laughs> All right. Oh, and from now on, just to save you guys some time, I'm gonna also let uh, edit the uh, loading timeout. All right. Okay, let me see. Where is this place at? Look left. I think we went to the wrong spot. Left. You gotta keep looking in the sky, Amy. All right. Higher ground? I think we went to the wrong one. Oh, there it is. Whew. All okay, right. Gotta run. Uh, whistle exploit, Amy. You're gonna run out of energy. All right. <laughs> God, this is so cheap. <laughs> hey, it works. Right? I see that guy over there like, hey, dude, you want, you want to lend me your uh, horse? I'll bring it back to you. <laughs> huh. Speaking of horses, uh, we already have like three or four Eponas right now. Right. Yeah, I guess I uh, was testing out the uh, cards that my uh, former roommate gave me before he moved back. Um, yeah. Well, not back to us, but he moved back to his home play, home country, but, you know. Okay. All right, teleport. Oh. Uh, wait, no, pick up your stuff. Okay, heal. Heal? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I meant to press right. the, the, the button, but two I never did. Two steaks. Okay. Two steaks? Are you sure? I yes. could eat something not, like this. Uh, okay, two of those then. Okay. You, you okay, I was about Close. to say, you almost ate three. He's, yeah. look, he's looking at me like, I'm going to get you. And like the other guy behind him, too. <clears throat> at the top of, well, I warn you that getting up there, yeah, damn, it's still raining. It's going to be a long well, way. Well, there is a reason why it's raining. And also, I think I think. Oh, yeah, those of towers, course. I know why. I remember now. Yeah, I think those towers are the ones that you don't slip from. Because they are actual bars that you hold on to. Oh, yeah. I remember now. Yeah, so go up that little zigzaggy way up the left. Yeah, I took the the other way around, but then again, if I didn't do that, I wouldn't have seen that little star fragment. Yeah. We need those. Also, you almost died and you took a picture. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> and then this little little bastard. <laughs> there you go, karma. Karma's a bitch, ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Excuse my language, guys. That's fine. Whoop. Right. Too bad for you. Just... Okay, Palatina. Hey, Palatina's awesome. I love her hair. I want to have hair as long as hers. Seriously, that, it's like really cool. Yeah. I think like long hair is like awesome. All right. But. Yeah, go ahead and get their parts. This is still a new profile. We we need something that'll give us money. Oh, you, oh I should have sneaked up behind it. That's fine. Okay, now this is probably gonna be difficult. Um, mm. left, gl gl down, look down, Amy, G glide down there, see if you could, okay, maybe that's risky, oh, shit, okay, what the heck, the archers, okay, oh. you know, go, go down that side, okay, because we, we actually broke from our path from here, yeah, we did, yeah, ignore those guys, I'm just gonna go the other way around, yeah, you really gotta watch out for those archers, because I got, uh, two-shotted, in a previous episode. Yeah. Oh, and he's trying to come at me. Really? You little... Maybe they're actually running away. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about the fireflies. Uh, I just wanted to get them just for something. Okay, I hope I could just sneak up behind them. Oh, you son of... Ouch. 
All right, cool. Okay. Yeah, Zora weapons, even though they are uh, weak. Ooh, Amy, it's not raining. Uh, go ahead and climb. Gotcha. You know Zora weapons are uh, relatively weak. Their durability is amazing. Yeah. Uh, I think the same thing applies to uh, Gerudo weapons, too. But you guys will see who the uh, Gerudos are in the future. Mm-hmm. Um, oh. Just, just escape. <laughs> There's no time to combat these guys right now. Okay. Oh, you better not push me out. He doesn't see you. Alright. Well. Yeah, ignore him. Don't worry about him. Climb up that tower? Or this little thing? Okay. Alright. Where'd you get those? There's a Liz Alphos over there. Next to those two pieces of ores I want to get so bad, but... Oh, no, trust me. We're good on ores, because uh, off-camera, while we were taking our break, I already marked some Talus locations. Gotcha. Yeah, if anything, guys, go ahead and go for it. If anything, guys, uh, don't waste your time on uh, the ores, the ore blocks or whatever. I mean, yeah, do break them if they're conveniently there in your travel. And if, especially if they're those big, uh, those bigger ones. Yeah, those bigger ones are usually the prize. Yeah, the, uh, the, 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 the what should we call it? The uh, taluses is where I uh, farm for my ores. Sometimes I go for the ores in other places. Sometimes I usually um, go for the talus. Go, go ahead and equip the bandana. Oh. Speed up the process. Oh, you yeah. didn't need to drop. Let's see. Right. There you go. And then just go ahead and look like Marcus Phoenix. Oh, gosh. All the way back up. Get back in your hole. <laughs> uh. Oh, goodness. It's been a long time since I've played uh, Gears of War. Yeah, but we're Team Nintendo now. Yep. Yes, we chose this path because uh, it, it it's it's a lot more simple, and not only that, with our busy schedules, you know, we we like games that we could just pick up and put down at any time instead of treating it as if it's our baby. I like to get some things that it's just like a pick up and go thing, you know. Yeah, because. Because everyone has a busy schedule, everyone like tries to like make up time for like their free time or whatever, you know? Yeah. Not only that, I just kind of hate the way how Microsoft and Sony has turned. I mean, I'm not hating them too much, it's just business decisions, you know? For example, apparently, you know, they came up with their third Xbox One. Really? You know, yeah. There, there was Xbox One, Xbox One S, and then Xbox One X. Wow. You know, I mean, yeah, cool data and all that stuff, but, you know... To end the video, we're not going to bash on any other competing, you know, systems, but still, you know, it's just... Meh. Yeah, there's a door right there. Alright, well... Yeah. Until next time, guys, uh... This is uh, Taik. Oh God, I can't even speak. This is the Taik and Roost. And uh, is there anything you want to say before we uh, head out, Amy? Well, not much. I'll even just say, just um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, or whatever you want to do. Do whatever you want to do. I mean, uh, well, you, you you guys know how I don't really like saying that. I know. But um, if anything, uh, in the next episode, we'll ha go ahead and talk to the Zora and see what's going on in his life. Prince Sidon. Uh. Yeah, that Zora next. Yep. Well, All right. There it is, right there, right in front of us. All right. Bye bye for now. All right. Peace out, guys.